in, we're going to look at Jesus telling us to carry our cross. And that sometimes things might be a little bit difficult. So, the peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. And we bow our heads for our first prayer. We bring our crosses as we gather here today. Crosses of worry, fear, hope or love. Thank you, God, that you are always ready to welcome us, whatever crosses we are carrying. Amen. So in our story today, Jesus was heading towards Jerusalem with his disciples. He told his friends that when he got there, things would be hard. He would be hurt and killed. But on the third day, he would be alive again. Peter heard about this and shouted out, no, don't go. But Jesus was angry and Peter knew that he should not try to stop him. Jesus was doing what God had wanted. Jesus said to his friends, pick up your cross and follow me. It won't be easy, but one day you will be rewarded. Pick up your cross and follow me. So when we think of the cross, we think about Jesus on the cross, the fact that Jesus died for us. But he's also saying that we pick up our cross, it's like having a heavy load. Sometimes being a Christian and following Jesus isn't easy. Not everybody agrees with us. Not everybody wants to follow us on the same path. So I'm going to pass you over to Lizzie and Florence, who've got some craft ideas for you today, um, all about crosses. Thank you, Diana. So this week's craft, we'd very much like you to make a bookmark. So you can put it in your school reading books next week or whenever you go back to school and I've done two today haven't we I've done one and um, Florence has done another type of bookmark so this one's mine and all I've done is literally just cut out a cross um, and I have written I don't know if you can see that I follow Jesus and I have decorated it with um, silver glitter and Florence's one she's got two bits of paper stuck together there we go, and you have written, I follow Jesus. And Florence, what have you what have you decorated yours with? Pink spots and pink swirls and pink stars. There you go. So there's two types of bookmarks that we would like you to do. Um, and if, don't forget to send them in to us so we can put them on our Facebook page. Now back to Diana. Thank you ladies and we really hope you enjoy making these this week. In the next few days most of you will be returning to college or school and before our next prayer let's listen to what some of you are looking forward to. I'm looking forward to going to school because I will be able to see my new teacher and to play with my friends in the playground. I'm very excited about going back to school. Bye! I'm looking forward to go back to school because I get to see all my friends. I'm excited to go back to school because I want to see my friends again. I'm looking forward to going back to school because I get to meet my new teacher. So we bow our heads as we pray. Dear God, New beginnings are exciting, but they can also be hard. We pray for schools and colleges at the start of the new school year, and we ask your blessing on school children and students, the teachers and all the staff who help them. We pray especially for those beginning a new school or college, that fears may give way to confidence, that excitement may lead to creative learning, and that meaningful relationships friendships may be made. Be with all of us at times of new beginnings and help us to look forward with hope rather than fear. Amen. So let us say together the family prayer that Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread 
and forgive our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Now our song today is Never Give Up, as God is always there. Enjoy. be good it may be tough but God you are with us and your love is enough amen so I hope those of you who go back next week have a good week and you enjoy being back with your friends and in your classrooms we'll be back here next week on Facebook and we hope you will be able to join us and the blessings of God the Father Son and Holy Spirit be with us all amen <laughs>